Hi guys, I'm James from Glorious and today we are going to do something that has been requested many times. We are going to see what to expect from the upcoming M2 Enterprise Advance. For those who don't know, the M2 EA is DJI's latest drone in the Mavic 2 Enterprise series that could possibly be a true winner. It comes with an upgraded thermal and RGB camera. It plans to compete with the far more expensive drones in its class. Let's cut to the chase and get this test started. Today, we'll be simulating the visual sensors on the M2EA. To do this, we'll be enlisting the help of two more drones, the M300 and the Autel EVO 2. This will simulate what we would expect from the M2EA's image sensors. We'll be using the M300 with the H20T to replicate the M2EA's thermal sensor. Both sensors have the same resolution of 640x512. Have a look at the specs. To replicate the RGB sensor, we'll be using the Autel EVO 2 8K. This would give us a pretty good idea of what to expect. Have a look at the specs. In this part of the video, we will use the H20T to simulate the thermal video of the M2EA. One of the most frequent use cases for the thermal will be surveillance and search and rescue. Now let's look at the thermal images. The target is 50 meters away. What do you think? At 50 meters, this is what you'll see on the remote. This is 8 times digital zoom. You can clearly see the human targets. Now, let's move a little further. Say, 100 meters. Now, moving on to 100 meters. At zero zoom, the human target is still clearly visible. 4 times zoom and then 8 times zoom. You can start to see the 8x zoom, the target becomes pixelated, but it's still possible to identify them. Now, a little further, say 200 meters. At 200 meters, white hot is not that clear. We turned on the rainbow palette and we can clearly see there are hot objects there. But we can't quite make out if they are humans or not. At 4 times zoom, the resolution starts to get really pixelated. And at 8 times, we are unable to identify the human unless they are moving their arms. Now let's move on to the RGB camera. This is likely a Sony IMX586 sensor which has 8K video. Here we tried to simulate a car plate by having the text printed out at 36, 48, 72 and 150 font size. So let's look at the RGB images. The target is 5 meters away. What do you think? At 8 times zoom, all text can be seen clearly. Now, let's move a little further. Let's try 30 meters. 
at 30 meters, 8 times zoom, we can only see the font size 150 clearly. Now, let's move a little further. Let's try 50 meters. At 50 meters, even at 8 times zoom, we were unable to see the text at all. Note that we simulated this with another drone, therefore the final M2EA might have a much better signal processor than this. Now let's try something that would put the RGB sensor on the Altel EVO 2 to the test. Let's look at a building to spot some cracks. This test would test the quality of the sensor and the benefits of the higher megapixel count. Now, with 48 megapixels, another use case will be inspection of assets. Here, we took photos of various thicknesses from 1mm to 9mm to simulate cracks. The first photo is at 5 meters away. When zoomed in, we can clearly see all the lines. At 10 meters away, when zoomed in, we almost can't see the 1mm line. Given in a real environment, the contrast between the cracks and the background will be worse than what we have here.